Award is for Best Documentary in association with, and uh, I think you're a big fan of it, the Grierson's Trust. Ian, yes, did you know that the Grierson Trust exists to promote documentary filmmaking and to celebrate the work of John Grierson? I didn't know that. Did you know that? No, I just read it off the article. Ha ha ha, that's a joke. That's a little joke to get joke. us through the day. Okay, to give us nominations for Best Documentary, we have some bona fide acting royalty. Uh, last seen on the big screen in last year's epic fantasy film, John Carter. Oh, hey, you know what to do, everyone. Please welcome Art Malik. Art Malik, everybody. It's Art Malik, he's got a hat on. Yes, it's Art Malik, he's got a hat on. He's got a hat on it, Art Malik. Good afternoon. <laughs> Documentaries, I mean, they're the most difficult things to make. The nominations for Best Documentary are Charming Southwark, The Coming Museum London, Ghost Girl, Thomas Adams Media Arts Programme in WEM, Echoes of Substance Abuse, Twin Vision, Liverpool, Hopeless or Courageous, The Lighthouse Group, Bradford. Oh. And the winner of First Light doc Best Documentary is Echoes and Substance Abuse Twin Vision. I got into drugs when I was about 15 years of age. My friends were all smoking pot. And then, because I wouldn't smoke pot, they sort of stopped knocking for me. And then so I felt like they were going to abandon me sort of thing. Do you know what I mean? So that's how I started getting into it for peer pressure. Went from like every couple of days to like all day, every day, basically. I used to hide it well from my mother, and I remember the day, you know, she walked in the bedroom and she me with a needle and knocked me arm, and um, it broke, it broke, it just broke, and she just burst out crying. First of all, I'd like to thank all the young people that were involved in this film. They dealt admirably with a very difficult subject and there were some inspiring um, stories that came out of the project. Um, secondly, I'd like to thank First Life Films, who without them, none of this today or our film projects would be possible. And also two other filmmakers who never came up to the stage, Leila Romea and Wes Story, who were sat in the front there. So if you give them a big round of applause, please. I'm going to hand the mic over to Mike, who was in the film and is an inspiring young person who worked well with all the young people on the project. Hello. Um, first off, I'd just like to say I've put on a lot of weight since we made that. Um, <laughs> So I'm not looking forward to seeing this video back, but yeah, just thanks to everyone who was involved, you know, First Life for putting on the funding to make this happen, and all of yourselves for being involved in various projects. Sadly, none of the young people who made this uh, could be here today, so thanks to Twin Vision and all of the young people off Dodger State um, from Walton in Liverpool, so this is for all of them, so well done, thank you, cheers. Well done, guys. Give it up one more time, everybody. Congratulations. Congratulations. Woo! She says 